and mini crafts for little hands. And this week I'm going to show you how to make your very own space rocket. Let me show you what you're going to need. So you might need some, some wet glue and a paintbrush. I've got a plastic plate here and this is just to draw a big circle around. We're going to need some toilet rolls and what I've done here is I want to make a big rocket. So I've got two toilet roll holders and I've taped them together in the middle. So um, you might need some tape for that as well. So that's those. Then we're going to need a couple of strips of tissue paper and this is in fire colours so it looks like fire coming out of the end of the rocket. Then I've got some, some coloured foam paper here but you could just use card or paint your own. This is to make a little door and a couple of windows. And then I've got some um, yellow card here but this is for the roof of the rocket. So you could use any colour you wanted and that's, we're going to cut a big circle out of that to make a nice pointy roof. And then our rocket is going to be silver. So I've got some tin foil here, this is just from the kitchen. You only need a little bit, you might ask, need to ask an adult to help you get that. Okay, and that's everything. We're ready to start. So we're going to start off covering our rocket in the tin foil. So we'll take our rocket and lay it down and just roll the tin foil around it like that. And to secure it, you just push in the end. And it's good to do this as you go along because it makes it nice and tight and it means that it can fall out. So then just put in the ends here and tighten it up and then at the bottom and tighten it all up like that. So here is the main part of our rocket. So what's happening next now is we're going to put a little bit of glue inside here put in our fire for our rocket. So I've got my paintbrush and my glue here and I'm just going to paint in a little bit, just dab it around the edges and you don't need an awful lot because it will take ages to dry. So you want to just put a little bit in there and just right around the whole circle, just like that. Then I'm going to get my little strips of tissue paper and I'm just going to stick them in, press them inside. And you can let them hang out over the edges just while they're drying to the glue. We're just going to leave it down one side to dry. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the sheet of card that I had for my roof and I'm going to draw around this plate to make a nice big circle and cut that out. So now I've got a nice big circle. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut a slit up to the middle. And that will help me bend it around. That's going to be the top then of my little rocket. And then I'm just going to scoop that in underneath. And you can see then that's starting to make a nice little rocket shape. And we want to, or a nice pointed shape for the top of my rocket. So I'm just going to keep that, rolling that in nice and tight like that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to secure that with a little bit of glue. I'm going to hold on to it for a little bit so that it doesn't fall apart on me to dry now and it's fairly secure. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my rocket and I'm going to put on my doors and my windows and let those dry as well. So I've already cut those out. I've got a little door here, a nice little door shape and I've got two little circles for windows. That's them. Look at your work. All I need to do is put on my roof and I'm going to secure this by using a little bit of glue again just around the rim and it'll just make sure when we're flying our rocket that it doesn't, that the roof doesn't fall off. And just on like that there. And I'll probably give this a couple of minutes maybe even a bit longer, just to completely dry so that I know it'll be safe to fly my rocket. We'd love to see your rockets. Please do share them with us using the hashtag FE Art School. And I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye.